Okay, here's how to make um, my famous elastic band roller. This, will all, this is guaranteed to always work. Um, on one wind up it will go the length of a school hall. Uh, square section wood is 65 millimeters long. These are um, eight centimeter discs. I always push into foam blocks to be safe. We put the drawing pins in at 12 o'clock, 6 o'clock, 3 o'clock and 9 o'clock. If you don't have any of uh, these sponge blocks, uh, a block of plasticine do the same job. Car discs are available from my shop. Details on my website. Of course you can make your own. There we are. Now we tap the pieces of wood on with a small hammer. I've done this activity um, with year three upwards. When you put the second disc on, try and aim the drawing pin to go into the centre of the wood. One. Okay, we've got a nice rolling structure now. Now we're going to power it. We're going to use a number 18 elastic band. It is possible to thread it through with your fingers, but it's much easier if you use um, a small hook, such as this one I've made by bending up a paper clip. So, loop on the elastic band through the holes and then trap that end with a small piece of dowel. So that's held like that. Then pull out the rubber band. Next we slip on a small metal washer. That's there to reduce the friction. Then we're going to use this wheel as a spacer. And that goes through as well. And then finally open up the band, put a long stick through take the hook out and that's the finished roller. You wind it up by holding it in one hand and turning the stick with the other. You can turn it up to about 50 or 60 times and on one wind up it will go the length of a school hall.